My name is Abdul, and I am an extreme cheapskate. I basically run a successful business. I have a mobile food business with the hot dog carts. This is my trusty friend here, Mr. Wiener. When I pull out my wiener, that's when the magic happens. He's pulling his cock out! This is my spot over here, what I call the man cave. I thought, wow, I could probably save mm, five or six hundred dollars by not buying a desk. In terms of how much I saved on keeping things the way they are and necessities only, uh, I have saved upwards of $45,000. It's driving everybody crazy because we don't have a phone here. We used to spend about 120 a month on our phone bill, and that's just way too much. If I need to get a hold of somebody, I just walk over to the library. It's less than a block away. <laughs> One of the ladies from Zumba said, hey, my grandpa just passed away if you want to live in our condo for free. Uh, this is all from when the guy passed away. He left it all here. I didn't have any furniture. It worked out nice. These are my roommates. We got Raj and Kevin here. It's painful bringing women back to the apartment because furniture is everything. It's embarrassing. Mom! What do you need? I don't have any clothes. There's a dress. That's horrible looking. It's like for a four-year-old. 75% off or less. Find anything? Yeah, a couple things. So, display. OK, so I need all these. I want these shoes. How much are shoes? <gasps> Ugh. This shirt, it's only $2. $2 is a lot. At a garage sale, it would be like 25 cents. My family is always asking me, how much money do we have? So I let them look at something that shows them how much money we have. When they leave, I go, here, there are 10 accounts that no one knows about. <laughs> In my credit union account, there's $21,000. <laughs> I would never pay for paper plates or any kind of plate, really. I got lucky. I got these for my, uh, my nephew's birthday party. I thought it was quite amazing that my aunt and uncle just happened to show up on our family dinner day. They're throwing off my budget completely. Uh, this is my closet. When I go shopping, I always leave the tags on the shirt because you never know if it's going to go out of style. So always keep the tags, and you can just return them later. Pizza. This is just so good. OK, what is this? That's, that's fine dining, mother. All right, looks like a wet noodle. Well, the napkins say 16, but I'm sure we're going to make it to 16 years of blissful marriage, so hey. Surprise! My wife was a little surprised at first, but she settled in, and I could tell that she knew that I really loved her. And it's the thought that counts in the end. Yeah. Abdul is a cheapskate, but I mean, most husbands forget anniversaries. Abdul did, he remembered it, he planned a party, he went through a lot of work to get everything all put together. This girl's kind of hot. Uh, she likes fancy restaurants and traveling. <laughs> Next. All right, and here's one. She likes shopping and wine tasting. <laughs> That's way too expensive. Easy going, homebody, good cook. Oh, she likes camping. Oh, and she likes long walks. Long walks are free. I like this one. I'm going to try some of your salad. Oh. What do you have in here? There's clover and sage blossoms. Is this a regular thing for you, too, is to pick Other people's weeds? yard trimmings? <laughs> they were our yard trimmings. Like <laughs> These are all things we made out of roadkill. It's just not my thing picking up roadkill. 